the man of God in my dream. I saw men of God in my dream. I saw men of God in my dream. Uh, I saw you. Then you, I saw you. You, you are telling, you are telling devil that devil, I deliver you. I, I mean, you are defeated. You are defeated. You are defeated. And the other thing which I saw, I saw a new water. God tell me that that new that, that new water will go to, to UK. So that's why I'm here to testify that man of God, you are a great man of God. I'm the man of God. I, I, I can deliver, but God talked to me through you that man, Apostle J.B. McAnese is a man of God. And the water is going to UK, man of God. Water is going to UK. Okay. So, people of God, okay. understand the man of God. Understand the man of God. He is the man of God. Uh, you can hear, there's nobody who's supposed to speak for me. Uh, I've got a pastor already. We've got charities in the UK. Charis is there already. You have got two branches in London, even in Manchester. And this man. So, what you saw is for yourself. If God revealed anything about yourself, keep it to yourself. If you dream, don't come and tell us. It's for yourself so that you pray about it. It's not for you to come and tell us that anointing water will go away. No. Uh, we know anointing water is for everyone. UK is nothing. America is nothing. Heaven and earth belongs to God. I'm, I'm just trying to tell you uh, what you saw. You're a man of God from where? Let me just, where do you come from? Uh, I stay in Don Park. Yeah, please, Park. please. Once you find somebody like me, whether I'm a man of God or not, uh, please, don't, don't say anything. It's Amen. for yourself. Amen. Yeah, because what we need to do now is not man of God, it's Jesus. Amen. Amen. It's not man of God. I think you've been praising, you've been praising us a lot. Mm. What about Jesus? So for you to get a revelation like this, please tell people to go to Jesus. If they come to you, they say, I want to go to Charis. I want to go to Charis. Uh, you just say, yeah, just go there. Go we'll help you. Because Amen. already you found revelation. Amen. But please, I'm not in a position where someone must speak up for me and say, I know you're a man of God. I know you're... No, I mean, if not, I was supposed to have left 15 years ago. Yeah. 15 years ago. So what you need to do now is a revelation for you. What you can do now is to say, oh... Now I got revelation. All right. I know this man is a man of God. Maybe God wants you to pray for me. Okay. Or maybe God wants you to reprimand people there. So don't come here and say, hey, hey this man of God, the anointing water is going to UK. It's going. What is UK? <coughs> because already gospel has reached there. If gospel is there, anointing water will be there. Amen. So don't worry. I'm just saying this so that you must not repeat this mistake. I'm afraid of being praised by men. Amen. <laughs> I'm really afraid. Amen. Because God, God has made men to praise him. God bless you. And I'm very happy for you for that dream Amen. that you have dreamed. Amen. And uh, I believe whoever, you are the one now to help people there. These people who are here, they know. Uh, people cannot come here without revelation. They know. So you are the one who can help people there. And say, oh, I got this revelation. No. Maybe there are people around you who are telling you that this man is not a man of God. Amen. So you are the one now who can say, hey, you know what? I got this revelation. I got... That revelation is for that. So God loves you. Amen. It's, it's as good as now uh, we are taking book of charis to all over the world. It's all, you see the book of charis, already deliverance uh, one, I mean, it's called what that book? Life of a Victoria life, Christian. Life of Victoria Christian one. Already you could see it is everywhere. With a different picture. There are people who are publishing it. They want the whole world to know. Even the issue of the deliverance, uh, everybody needs deliverance. That book is going to be all over the world. Please, you don't need to dream about it. 
Don't dream about it. Don't come and tell us. What you need to do, buy it. Like yourself now. You bought it now. Amen. Yeah, that's what you can do. You keep quiet. You just buy it. You don't dream it. After you dream it, buy it. Have more. Use it. God bless it. Amen. So, if you want that book, buy it. Buy it. Buy it. If you buy it, you have it. It's yours now. You can other, tell other people around you who will say, this book can help. You give them. You give them. So, this book can help. I'm sure you understand what I'm trying to say. That's the reason of your revelation. If God reveals something to you, don't run to your pastor. What if you are getting revelation which is not true? So now, the moment when, let's take now, God gave you a revelation about your pastor, and the pastor is jumping on people, and you have never seen him jumping on people. I'm sure you understand that. So when you are asleep, you see your pastor jumping on people, jumping like people. Just say, no, 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 this anointing, no, 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 no. No. Now you go and pray now. You ask God, God, why am I seeing pastor jumping on people? Lord, why am I seeing pastor jumping on people? God will tell you, no, no, this man is not him. It's the devil who gave you that vision. Because some visions now, you are misled out of those dreams. You just see your auntie coming to give you food when you are asleep. From there, you don't want to greet your auntie. And then now witches came here by the eyes of, by the body of the auntie. My wife was giving me a, a, a dream today. She said, she dreamed too much. She see a lot of vision. She said, ah, I saw a person like you baptizing. So I was excited to say, I'm going to baptize. When I reached there, I found these occultic people. The moment when I put my leg there, the water came down. And I see clear who's there. So I said, yeah. You could not know this person or become interested if you didn't see me in the vision. So for you to go there is because you saw me and baptizing. But when you reach there, you know now. So even when you dream, you need to pray so that you reach there, you understand. Because otherwise you would, you, you see this vision, you see this one, you see, even the prophets, I want to tell prophet, when you prophesy, you say on the first or second or what, something will happen. You must check clear. You must check clear because otherwise people will say you're not a prophet. So you must pray more, more to find out if truly this will happen on that date. It's no issue of just coming out and say, yes, I'm sitting out the second or fifth or twenty. What will happen now? These people will go and sit down and look at the date. They see it's not happening. They say, ah, you're not a prophet. I'm sure you understand that. So all of us, we have got that obligation. The moment when God shows us, we run there to him more. We want to find more. So that we speak, oh, you see, it won't happen. Otherwise, we will make it happen. It's as good as I say, you see, you are going to die this year, and later I go on the other side to come and shoot you. You are going to be sick this year and die. Later, I go on the other side to come and shoot you now. Later, I say, oh, God told me about this, that this man will die this year. But you say you will be sick. So shooting... It's no sickness. I'm sure you understand what I'm trying to say. So this is a mistake we are doing. I want to tell you that there's someone who's been delivered right now. Amen. Everybody can declare. Everybody can prophesy. Everybody can see a vision. But to come to pass the way you saw it, matters. It comes from far. Like him, if you want this to come to pass, what you need to do, oh, I saw this thing. Let me pray more about it. Until God show him something. So, him, after he saw the anointing water, whatever, whatever, God tell him, oh, he's a man of God. But there's more God wants to tell him. What God wants to tell him, he wants me to pray for him. Yeah? That's, that's true. I saw, first of all, I saw you, you were sprinkling water on me. After sprinkling water on me, and then you were telling the, the congregation, I'm sorry to say that, but in, there was a huge inside of my heart for three weeks, so I must say this. 
So I have been trying to, to, to send the message. But you were sprinkling water on me, and that water, in my dream, I was asking, what this water for? And the, word, the, the God says, tell, tell me that this water is also go to UK. It's powerful water. You can see now. That's the revelation for him. Because he was doubting. Let's leave it. Uh, I think every doubt uh, will be answered today in Jesus' name. Yeah. I'm, I'm sure you understand. He, 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 he saw me spraying water, spraying water. He said, hey, I'm a gugu, a little Israel. Hey, I'm a gugu. I'm sure, I, I hope I'm a tunani. Hey, I'm a tunani. I'm sure you saw that. So he, he concluded, he said, no, this man might be witching me. Now, later he hear revelation. So, uh, he might have been saying that, but God has forgiven. I will pray for him. God loves him.